best cauliflower soup recipe ever. Oh, this really is a good one. What you're going to need is around about 200 grams of onion that has been chopped. Then you're going to take two cloves of garlic and roughly chop those two. Then one stick of celery that's been chopped. Pop that all to one side for one moment while we deal with the cauliflower. So you're going to need 550 grams of cauliflower and yes I am using the tender leaves as well as the florets. Just roughly cut it all up because it all makes it taste good. In a pan pop some olive oil in along with around about 30 grams of butter. Melt that down. Then you're going to add in the celery, the cloves of garlic and the onion. Sauté that down for around about five minutes until it's soft and translucent. Pop in a bay leaf, this really does add so much flavour. Then I like a good sprinkling of chilli flakes. I'm adding in one litre of chicken stock. You can use vegetable stock, but make sure it's good quality. Then pop in your cauliflower and give it a good mix round. Pop a lid on top and simmer for around about 15 to 20 minutes until the cauliflower is tender. I'm going to be blending mine using my KitchenAid blender set. Oh, so many good gadgets with this. Don't forget to take that bay leaf out first before you do any blending and then it literally is a case of just making sure you blend it until it's smooth. If you want it silky smooth you can pass it through a sieve afterwards and that really helps. Now for extra naughtiness I do like to add a little bit of double cream so I whiz that in there and then you need to serve it. What can you serve it with? Well, there's lots of different things. Why not try some parsley, rocket, pancetta, crispy bacon, croutons? Oh, I'm sure you're going to enjoy this one. For more delicious recipes and tips, tricks and advice, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel or go to my website, cookingwithemily.co.uk.